Thomas said, from Ghana. Uh, since this is a summary, I'll rush through it quick, and afterwards, if there will be any questions, I'll be glad to answer them. All right, from the project in the northern part of Ghana, we took steps to implement change into the community on grassroots levels. And from here, you'll see, I'll give a summary quickly. There will be a video on in depth on Friday, so you can see how everything went along. Okay. So on this, on the project to access clean water, was able to use the phone to send information to these villagers, where we found it was a lot easier, and also it was easier for them to access the information because they were able to go back and look at what they had to do instead of calling us every time to say, can you come down, we are stuck. Uh, though in developed countries, M-Learning is broad, as, what do you call it, is broad. We, well, we have to stick with sending SMS, right? Where others use the latest forms like Blackberries and so on and so forth. We, we use what we had, and we're able to get the job done. So where there is problems, it's not an obstacle where it should come to a halt. We still have to move on, and we build on what we have. So as you can see, we was able to implement everything that we needed to get done. We we're able to send our information using the basic fonts, and we still got everything done. Emphasizing that this was on a trial basis to identify and correct where issues that affected the progression of M-learning were able to move on.